This segment will show you how to determine which plants are male and which are female and the possible benefits of gender identification. Some people find it necessary to remove male plants to eliminate pollination because female plants are often the ones that produce prize buds and flowers. In order to remove the male plants, first you must sex your plants. This is only necessary if starting from seeds since all clones will be the same sex as the parental donor. First, get a magnifying glass and look at where your stem branches off into new growing tips. With males, you can see they have a more bulbous, almost nut-shaped growth, which clusters together at the base of the nodes and tips of the growing terminals. Females, on the other hand, have tiny white or yellow hairs, known as pistils protruding. Usually, your plants will start showing sex within one week of starting the flowering cycle. The flowering cycle is started by switching your light cycle, as described in the lighting section, and changing your plant nutrients. Do not check on the status during your dark phase or you can slow down the time it will normally take to show your plant sex. If you need to check on your plants during the dark cycle, get a green light bulb or flashlight from your local department store. Your plants don't process the green spectrum of light, hence the plant color being green, due to absorption of all other colors. The heights listed above will give you a general guideline of how your plants will develop. If you want to determine which plants are male and which are female earlier on, then get a small black plastic bag or something similar that is light proof and a plastic coated twist tie. Select a plant that you would like to sex and choose a growing tip. Take the plastic bag, place it over the top of the selected tip and seal with the twist tie. Then to simulate the flowering phase, simply remove the bag after the 12 hour dark period and replace it when the 12 hour light cycle ends. After 7 to 10 days, the growth tip you covered should start showing signs of its gender. If you follow the section's guide to sexing and flowering your plants, you will maximize the quality production from your unit.